Praise the Lord. Hello. My name is Pastor Arthur T. Lewis Jr. from Christ is the Answer Deliverance Center. From my home to yours, I'd like to take the opportunity to wish you a happy new year. As I look back at 2020, and I first of all think about all the different things that we had to go through, and now when I look at 2021, I have to say, to God be the glory. You know, moving into 2021, my prayer is that we operate with that same mindset, the mindset of an overcomer, to know that God is who he says that he is, and most of all, capable of doing what his word says that he can do. And so as we move forward into 2021, move forward with the mindset of an overcomer, to know that those obstacles that were there in front, you overcame those things. And now you can talk about the victory in Jesus Christ. Proverbs 3, 5, and 6, it says, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not into your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. When I think about that, it says trust with all your heart. That means your entire being. That means all that you are, you trust God. You give it all to God. You know, sometimes we pick and choose what we want to give to God. Give God everything, the little things, the big things, trust with all your heart. And then it goes on, it says, and lean not into your own understanding and all your ways acknowledge him. In other words, stop trying to figure it out for yourself. Let God have it. He's able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all we can ask or think. However, the word says it's according to the power that's working in us. Again, as we look forward to 2021, the one thing that we're going to need to operate in 2021 is the peace of God. Isaiah 26 and 12 reads, it says, Lord, you will establish peace for us. In other words, it's God who establishes the peace. Isaiah 26 and 3, it says, you will keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you. In other words, regardless of what the situation may be, regardless of what it may look like, regardless of what the people may say, God says, keep your focus on him. God says, keep your focus on him so that he can grant you the peace. And he said that he give it to those whose mind is stayed on him. I'm not saying that every time a particular situation might change, but what I'm saying is your perspective on a situation will change and he will grant you the peace that you need. As we continue in 2021, one thing that's going to be very, very important in our lives, Colossians 3 and 17, it says, and whatever you do in word or deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. So no matter what it is, it says, let God be honored and glorified as we bless people. And so when you look at it from that particular perspective, it lets us know that God is in control and God has given us the wherewithal to bless him, to honor him, to worship him, to magnify his holy name. And so I say to you, Happy New Year. And my prayer is that God will continue to grant you his perfect peace. We love you in Jesus' name. God bless. Peace.